Now, you've read the title of this video and you probably clicked because you think I'm wrong. Let me educate you on all the reasons that I'm right. First things first, you have to understand what IT is. IT refers to the use of computers and their methods of storing, processing, even securing electronic data. In simpler terms, it's the use of technology to better assist companies in their day-to-day -day lives. You have to understand that technology is rapidly advancing and companies are in dire need of individuals who can keep up with this tech. When things break, which they will, you will see people and companies get extremely desperate, especially when technology that they need to run their business is not working. This is when IT professionals are worth their weight in gold. IT professionals are the beacons of hope because they can diagnose technical problems and fix them. And to many, the world of technology is extremely intimidating. Many people believe it involves complex maths or concepts that are impossible to understand. Little do they know, it's one of the few in the STEM field that doesn't require a college degree to land a job in. Many of my colleagues, even managers, don't have a technical background. They never went to college and they don't have fancy degrees from fancy schools. Instead, these people have usually developed their knowledge online. Courses, boot camps, certifications. These are all the most commonly used methods to enter this field. And the awesome thing is that these methods are cheaper than college, quicker than college, and easier than college. In IT, they don't care where you came from. You could have just came from your mother's basement. What's important is that you're teachable and technical enough to do the job. There are no required licenses, no standardized tests. There is no governing body regulating the IT world. The way the game goes is simple. Land a technical interview, answer the questions, and get a job offer. The hard part is getting that interview. But at the end of the day, as long as you follow the blueprint, it's just a numbers game in regards to getting an interview. And when I say blueprint, I simply mean you've mirrored someone's steps that has done this already. I'm 27 years old. I've been in the IT field for the last year and five months. I'm a remote monitoring and management engineer who's also specializing in EDR, which has to do with cybersecurity. I've dedicated the last year and a half of my life to getting in this field and leveling up while I'm here. I believe it's beneficial for people to see someone who's on the same journey as them, not someone who's a director and far removed from the process. People need someone they can get tips from who's actually in the line of fire currently. That's me. I know how hard it is to get your foot in the door, but listen, when I was injured from FedEx, I locked down for an entire month and grinded and studied. That month of studying allowed me to get an offer from Disney as the sole application analyst in Orlando, a contract for 12 months. That IT job single-handedly changed my life. Now I work for a billion dollar IT company and they have their name on the Miami Heat arena. But the reason I'm so biased towards IT is because in this short time I've been in IT, it's allowed me to move out of my mom's house into a downtown high-rise apartment. I've got my Q50 Red Sport that I was always dreaming of. I'm able to take vacations with my girlfriend regularly. I'm a college dropout and I lack self-confidence because I had never done anything worth being confident about. I knew I needed a skill that I could take in life with me. I did a lot of research and that's what led me to the Course Careers IT program, which changed everything. Instead of paying like thousands and thousands of dollars for an IT boot camp or something, I did this instead. I was able to completely revamp my resume with their help. I was able to build hands-on technical experience by building a tech portfolio, and I had that for my resume. I was guided in making a perfect cover letter, so that was never empty in my applications, and I earned an IT certification that I could print out and I could put on my resume. Guys, right now, IT, information technology, is only about 20 to 30 years old. It's still in its infancy. As AI technologies advance, you will see a huge demand for engineers who can harness this tech. And I hear many people on my social media reference these tech layoffs in 2024 that they heard on the headlines. But in reality, guys, the only reason it was on the news, it was 
because it was the bigger companies. They don't explain how these smaller organizations are siphoning from those bigger companies and these smaller organizations are blowing up and they have huge workloads. It's also been reported that 2025, the IT job market should stabilize drastically. Within the next 10 years, IT, web development, cybersecurity, they're projected to be some of the fastest growing professions. With inflation increasing, people need to make more money. And as long as you self-develop in your free time, this career can help you make over six figures in just a couple years. Almost a quarter of the century is already completed. Over the years, technology will play a bigger and bigger role in our day-to-day -day lives. I truly believe you'll begin to see a division of wealth between people who harness technical skills and people who don't. Developing skills in information technology is a surefire way to improve your future financial situation. Now, if you guys want, you can check out the link in this video description to take the same program that I started with, the same program that I took. I followed my friend's footsteps, clicked on actually his link. That's how I was able to get a $50 discount. So if you guys want that same discount, you guys can click the link in the description. You can take a look at my other videos to learn more about my journey and to gather tips that you can take with you on your journey. And I really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video, watch all my videos. If you guys stuck to the end, message me on LinkedIn with a one to 10 rating of the video. If you liked it, if you didn't like it, let me know. It really helps me know what you guys want to see in the future. I want to make sure you guys like my videos and actually find them valuable. If you aren't subscribed, hit that button. DM me on TikTok for quick responses while it's still here, I guess. I'll do the best I possibly can to get back to everyone. Take care, YouTube family. Have a great new year. Remember, the more learning, the more earning. Let's get it.